McCullough on the move. Up ahead, Furphy at the basket. Flips it in. And we're tied. Butler, he's going to have to make shots in this one. Oh, the ESPN app just saw Texas on Saturday against Baylor. They went nine. The Longhorns went nine of 11 from three in the first half. Kevin McCullough averaging 20 points a game. Yes, it had too many 20 point scorers. They haven't. Frank Mason was one. Wayne Simeon, when he first got here back in, what, 04, 05? Or maybe it's 03, 04. Kansas trying to break a 35 all time. And for the most part, Cincinnati's done a really good job with their transition defense. They haven't given up a whole lot in the open floor. Still intact, ripped away. McCuller off to Furphy. Whole crew will be in the house as McCuller. I mean, he's leading the conference in rebounding. He's been spectacular. But McCuller does so many things for this team. Due to that two time transfer rule. Beat inside to Adams. Harris at the basket, left hand. And Furphy rebounds. McCuller. Skilling's inside. No call. Bit of a wild shot. What a pass. A great look finds Furphy. If you're a Big 12 fan, you got to have it sign up today at ESPN+. Plus. Cincinnati got a win at BYU. That's a tough place to go into and get a W. Really tough place. Yeah, Dewan Harris, Jr., Kansas is the, the reigning defensive player of the year in this league, and he's got a defensive player of the year candidate. Harris ball fake off the glass and good. In the second half, it's remarkable that they're within two possessions. Got a little loud in here. Just in case you were wondering, that was 124 decibels. Golly. McCullough step back. He just played another terrific all-around game. Performer on any team in the Big 12 is Kevin McCullough.